Hi, we are FS Ingenium Team. You are going to see that Picasso, apart from being a good artist, was also a thinker. And he was right when he said that. His vision exists, but you have to find your work. Follow this ball because it's a great story to tell. Water is a scarce and passing need. According to the Food and Agricultural Organization, our 70% of world's fresh water is used by the agricultural sector. Without water, there are no crops, but excessive real rates on can cause one, wasting natural resources. Second, on farmlands in cool, run their roots, loss of water for percolation, soil erosion, and loss of nutrients for crops. And third, environmental consequences. Changing the composition of microorganisms in wetlands and contamination of water for human consumption. The target is to optimize irrigation. Now is innovation time. Experts agree soil moisture monitoring is key to optimal water management. Here we have a table which contains pros and cons of the current humidity sensors. These humidity sensors produce up to 40% of the 40% of the, of the water consumption, but their usage is not widespread. Our proposal has two essential parts, a device made up of a ceramic separate and safe case which contains the two main sensors, the electronics and the battery, and the telecommunication system which shows what information is sent through the gateway to the remote platform on the cloud. As you can see on this table, our innovation has clear advantages. As well as sensor display, increases reliability of readings. Current sensors informs about the amount of water in the cell. We are showers about, about humidity of the soil. We are showers tells us about availability of water from the plant. It also informs of the soil types. The spherical shape simplifies its placement. It's adaptable and efficient in different types of soil, ground irregularities, and different types of crops. It's wireless. It has low cost materials and it's unique. There's nothing like it on the market. We name it the Hydro Ball. And this very gem, it was very important to bring quality to the process. Here's our design process. First, we molded and baked the ceramic clay. The next step was to join the electronic components of the sensors to the motherboard. We made a simple programming Arduino that sends a long range signal with low consumption from the ball to a server located on the cloud that displays information through graphics to our mobile devices. All this improvement process, process is based on a continuous improvement system through an iteration process. We have built up to three series of Shanghai jewels reaching an amazing working prototype. All these changes have been documented in the engineering change notice. What a beautiful job, time to evaluate and verify step by step. We pair the high jewels in vermicry, perlite, and pink to test them and compare them with the current sensors. The experiment was awesome, accurate, and ran your measurements, and the ability to differentiate soil types were confirmed. Now it's time to conquer the world. The Hydroball, the Hydroball has been already chosen by various associations and institutions. Some examples are Floret, which is a pre-packed vegetables company, Cooperativa Tajona, and Pablo de Reza, which is a wine producer for their agricultural operations as well as the Public University of Navarra and the Institute of Agrobiotechnology for research purposes, especially for a European Institute of Innovation and Technology food project for precise agriculture. Also, Vodafone and Tarai, which is a group from the Public University of Navarra, have chosen it for developing a cloud infrastructure for the automation of agricultural processes. With the high level, the era of focus of agriculture has begun. At this point in time, with a patent already presented, we are working on engineering changes directed to large-scale sales production. Some of these changes are already in development. Unlike the current sensors, which can cost up to $150, our goal is to reduce the production cost to below $20, including the data transmission system. It is a great market opportunity. Only 10% of the farmlands are currently being monitored. A high level could be extended to small and large scale farmers, domestic users, as well as ornamental and recreational gardening. As we have stated on our value proposition canvas, for the farmer, it will be the best investment of his life. For the domestic user, a great solution with which to enjoy his garden. Picasso was right, inspiration found the working, and look what they were able to create.